A local dog is dead tonight. It was killed by police after it allegedly attacked a child, a security guard, and a police officer. Good evening, everybody. I'm Kimberly Gill. Three people were injured tonight in a dog attack in the city's Crafton Heights neighborhood. Ralph Iannotti is live at Children's Hospital with more on this story. Ralph? Well, good evening, Kimberly. The police officer was bitten on the leg, a security officer scratched and bitten on one of his hands, and the six-year-old boy was bit on his side. He'll likely require some stitches, and he was brought here to Children's Hospital uh, to be treated. I thought somebody actually got shot, like somebody, like a person. But the gunfire that neighbors heard in the Mountain View Apartments on Crucible Street was not someone shooting at someone else randomly. A Pittsburgh police officer shot and killed this year-old lab pit bull mix named Cola after the dog not only attacked a six-year-old boy, but also a Mountain View security guard and a city police officer as well. The dog was finally put down in this field where it was running free. And then I see somebody had a hold of the dog over there, and um, I guess that the, uh, the dog must have went a little crazy, and they shot the dog three times. Like three times, like pow, pow, pow. And then I looked outside, and I just saw, like, them. Like, there was, like, a whole bunch of cops over there. Neighbors I talked to indicated they thought police had little choice but to shoot the dog because of its aggressive behavior. They could have done it a little different. However, the dog's owner, who did not want to be identified, said she was disappointed with the way the animal was put down by police. She started running around barking because there's, like, five cops there. And uh, they started tasing her. And then after they tased her a couple times, they uh, decided to shoot her. Now, fortunately, none of the injuries uh, related to this dog attack tonight are considered life-threatening. And since the dog was roaming free, Pittsburgh police expect the dog's owner to be charged with a violation of the city's leash law. We're live tonight outside Children's Hospital. I'm Ralph Iannotti, KDKA-TV News on Pittsburgh CW.